And now this week, we catch up with the editorial gang from Inside Motorcycles magazine. After spending a couple of days hanging around with a cluster of motorcycles we call naked bikes. What's a naked bike, you ask? Well, in Europe, they're better known as street fighters, a category first created with the assistance of Ducati when they unleashed their famous monster. Basically, a naked bike has a very powerful motor, not a lot of bodywork, so you can see that motor, and most importantly, a naked bike must have personality that screams, let's go play. For this shootout, Inside Motorcycles chose the Buell Lightning, Kawasaki's Z1000, BMW's Rockster, Suzuki's SV1000S, Triumph's Speed Triple, and Yamaha's FZ1. Colin Fraser of Inside Motorcycles picks up the tail of the tape after two days of riding naked. So Colin, we're talking about a naked bike shootout. What was the criteria this time around? Well, a naked bike is a category that came about really more than anything from the Ducati Monster. They took a popular engine chassis type package, retweaked it a bit and turned it into what could be called a street fighter if you're from the UK and that's a more sit up riding position, comfortable around town, stunt worthy kind of motorcycle and it's a really uh, useful category because it's very comfortable, it's great around town, it's not bad depending on the configuration for longer trips, it's very versatile, it's very much harkening back to the old universal Japanese motorcycle, of course Ducati had nothing to do with that. Right, they do have to have a certain amount of power, right? Almost all of these bikes are defined by an extremely strong engine, an engine that may well be the best motor that that manufacturer has in their lineup, and whether it's Triumph's Triple, the R1-based engine here, BMW's famous twin, on and on and on, all these bikes have in common a really terrific engine as a starting point. So Mark, you started out the day with six bikes. you got to get it down to at least one or two. How are things going right now? Well, again, this has been a really tough shootout. All these bikes are excellent. I mean, you have the, the Buell Lightning up there. It's a great street fighter, all around fun. Everybody loves it, but you know, I don't know if you'd want to take it for the distance. Uh, the SV up there, also another great bike, another nice naked naked bike, but it's, uh, it seems to be a little more sporting oriented in its, in its um, riding position. Right. And then you have uh, the Triumph, the Cowie, which are street fighters, but excellent uh, naked bikes as well. Anybody would take one of those. And the FZ1 uh, meets uh, a lot of the criteria uh, for a naked bike shootout. It's, uh, it's a great bike. Sounds to me like there's a bit of a uh, discussion going on up there. It seems to be running down to the wire between the orange and the yellow. Yeah, that's, uh, that, that is the discussion. I think uh, uh, a few hours ago everybody was leaning on the FZ1 and we had a little discussion here and it seems we're leaning on the Cowie now. But uh, it's a real toss up. They're both great bikes. They're all, all of them here are great. The Triumph is a good bike and the BMW as well. It uh, cruises well on the highway. Well, everyone's smiling, that's for sure. Yeah, that's the, that's the best part of doing this. Everybody's having fun. It's a great day. Remember, if you want to read a full review of our Naked Bike Shootout, be sure to check out the latest issue of Inside Motorcycles magazine. Or stop by InsideMotorcycles.com.